Age is but a number, right? Well, what do you think about marrying somebody that is 33 years younger than you, and then having two children at the age of 70? It sounds crazy, right? Not for Richard Gere, because that's exactly what he did. From his award-winning movies like Pretty Woman, Primal Fear, An Officer and a Gentleman, and Chicago, to being voted Sexiest Man Alive in the 90s, Richard Gere is a legend in the entertainment industry. How obscene an amount of money were you talking about? Just profane or really offensive? Really offensive. I like him so much. Richard Gere needs no introduction, but his wife, Alejandra Silva, might. She was born in 1983 and is a Spanish publicist and human rights activist. Silva is passionate about helping those who need it, and she isn't afraid to get down and dirty doing it. The Spanish activist worked with a non-profit, hoping to end homelessness in Spain, her home country. I've slept on the street to understand the struggle of the homeless. I'm not scared of rolling up my sleeves and diving into work. If I do something, I put 100% effort in. If I can't, I'd rather not do it. Third time seems to be the charm for Richard, as he has now met who he calls the love of his life. The pair met when Alejandro was a young girl, as Gear was a family friend of her dad's. The family lost touch with Gear before Silva was a teenager, but they reconnected by chance again in 2014, and she was now married with a son. The pretty woman actor was visiting Positano in Italy, and he went to the hotel he was going to stay at. Alejandro was managing the hotel at the time as her family owned it. A friend reintroduced them, and they both instantly felt a very strong connection. Speaking about how they first met, Alejandra said, We looked at each other and felt a very strong connection. We couldn't stop looking at each other all night, and since then, we haven't been apart. She said that he sent her flowers until she agreed to go on a date with him, and it obviously worked. They began dating very quickly, even though the conditions weren't exactly ideal. When they started seeing each other, both Gear and Silva were going through divorces, Though this could have made their relationship more difficult, they used the shared experience as a way to bond and connect with one another. Love stories with a complicated beginning, where you have to overcome difficulties together, can bring you closer. I'm sure I did have some doubts at some point, in the beginning he was more convinced than me, but from very early on, we felt that we were destined to be together," Alejandra said. At the time she was divorcing a businessman and the pair share a son, Albert. Richard was on his second divorce. He first married Cindy Crawford in 1991, and the pair divorced in 1995. There was a 16-year age gap between her and Gear, and Cindy credits their separation to being very young at the time. I think I was more willing at 22 to be like, okay, I'll, I'll follow. And then you start going, well, I don't want to just follow. I want to lead sometimes, and I want to walk side by side sometimes. She was 25 at the time they got married, and didn't know if there was ever an element of friendship. She said, I don't know if we were ever friends, like peers, because I was young and he was Richard Gere. I started kind of growing up and growing into myself. It's hard to change the nature of a relationship once you're already in it. Seven years after the divorce from Crawford, he married Carrie Lowell, who is the mother of his first child, Homer. Richard seems to have met his match when he fell in love with Carrie. Out of all of his wives, the Law & Order star was the closest in age. She was only 12 years his junior. However, things turned ugly once Carrie filed for divorce in 2013. The pair quickly reached a joint custody agreement on their son, but their court battle was drawn out for three long years. Carrie fought hard for her former husband's $45 million fortune. They came to an agreement in 2016, but the terms of the settlement were never made public. By the time his divorce was finalized, Gear was already two years into a relationship with Alejandra, and even through the stress of a divorce, he had never been happier. It is unknown when the couple got engaged, and all the details about the proposal were also kept private, but Silva splurged a few little details about it in an interview. She revealed, This was a private moment, just the two of us. But what I can tell you is that he asked me to marry him in the most romantic hotel I've been to, in Saint Paul de Vence in the south of France on my birthday. I get emotional just remembering it. How sweet is that? Before their wedding in 2018, the activist changed her religion for gear. Silva was raised Catholic and she converted to Buddhism. The Spanish beauty had said that even though she was born a Catholic, she feels as though Buddhism was already inside her. She believes in reincarnation, so that's why she thinks she was Buddhist before realizing it. 
Talk about committing to her partner. Speaking about changing her religion, she said, I'll be eternally grateful to him, no doubt about it. Thanks to Buddhism, my life has changed. Leading up to the wedding, the couple invited both of their families to stay with them on a large property in Spain. 39 of their loved ones stayed on the property together for a full week. And when it was over, Silva said that seeing everyone spending time together made them fall more in love than ever before. Alejandra said, I never thought I'd find a man so perfect for me. I have no words to describe my happiness. When the wedding day arrived, it was just as romantic and extravagant as you can imagine. They converted Richard's New York ranch into an Indian-inspired fairy tale. The couple imported tents from Jaipur and decorated the property with flowers and Tibetan flags. They made their grand arrival in a tuk-tuk to surprise their guests. When he first saw her in her dress, the actor said that she was the most spectacular woman he had ever seen. She revealed, I couldn't stop smiling. I was very nervous. I said, I love you. The ceremony was beautiful. We exchanged rings our children brought us. It was so moving. As you can tell, they are both hopeless romantics, and Gear is always singing to his wife. Whether it's someone else's love song or the one he wrote for her, the serenading never ends. He holds true to say that she has made him the happiest man in the universe. We can't get enough of this couple. Alejandra has shared that her husband is the most humble, sensitive, affectionate, attentive, funny, and generous man she has ever met. What can I say? I'm so in love. How would you feel if each morning you were asked, what would make you happy today? Not a day goes by that he doesn't mention how important I am to him. Well, it would feel like the best dream ever, Alejandra. In 2019, the couple shocked fans as they revealed they were expecting a baby. At the time, Richard was 70 years old. They welcomed their son, Alexander, just a little less than a year after tying the knot. Then they shocked the fans when, again, nearly nine months after announcing the birth of the first son, they announced they were expecting again. The actor was almost 72 when they welcomed their second son, and the couple's hearts doubled in size. That took their total number of kids up to four. Richard's first son was already in his early 20s at the time. After the birth of their first son, Alejandra felt grateful for all the blessings in her life. I was a little lost, without life, and knowing him gave meaning to my life, she said. Many wondered about the repercussions of their children having a father that was so much older than the typical dad. This spurred a lot of talk about the couple's 33-year age gap, she then spoke about the age gap and their marriage in general. The Spanish beauty wasn't worried about having kids with Richard at his age, as she admitted that he has far more energy than she does, and he's much more active. She finds it hard to keep up with him most of the time. She said about the age gap, In this life, it had to be like this. He has promised me at least 20 good years. He knows I love him madly. Our karma was attracted the moment we saw each other. I'm not ignoring our age difference and what it means to be with a Hollywood star, but when there's such a strong karmic energy, the problems disappear. That's why I've decided to stay in it. The age gap doesn't bother Alejandra at all because she without a doubt feels like the luckiest woman in the world. Silva also believes it helps that she isn't an actress or model because there's a greater sense of stability in being outside Hollywood. What united the pair most was their desire to help people who needed it. As a humanitarian, it was the sweetest, most romantic dream that she had. To have a man that supported her unconditional commitment to helping and getting involved with her. The activist is much more vocal about their relationship compared to the primal fear actor, but when he does speak about his wife, it is straight out of a movie. He loves that she's a great cook who makes the best salads in the world, that she meditates, is a vegetarian, and a great mother. He said, I'm the happiest man in the universe. How could I not be? I'm married to a beautiful woman who is smart, sensitive, committed to helping people, who's fun, patient, who knows how to forgive, and has the touch of an angel. And she's also Spanish, the land of kings and queens. You can't get any better than that. Richard Gere and Alejandra Silva have a love story for the ages of all ages. Their relationship proves that love knows no age. From their first date to starting a family, every step of the couple's relationship seems to be taken straight out of a romance novel. Despite all their differences, their relationship is the ultimate testament that love conquers all. It's safe to say that both Gear and Silva will have their happily ever after.
there seems to be no obstacle that this power couple can't overcome.